just wanted to just wanted to show you share with you my graphing program that I made. I made it in a programming language called uh, Liberty Basic. I've already cleared the screen from the last uh, run, but if I want to re-graph it, all I have to do is just uh, uh, I think it was this one. Yeah, we drew the same graphs in a different color, so that way you know it's not new. Um, I can even save it as a bitmap, and then you just go into your your directory that you are running the program in, and just bring it right back up. And you can bring it up in a drawing program. You can print it out or whatever. Um, so I mean, it's you know it's pretty versatile. You know, you can bring it up in Paint or whatever and annotate on it. Um, so I just, you know, saving the bitmap is kind of nice if you want to uh, do something else with it other than just regraph it. And you can actually put more graphs on there at a time. So if I want to regraph the one before it, you know, you can see the the profile head. Uh, oh, if I just if I just clear the whole thing and grab that one, you can see I had some dropouts, um, and they were. Uh, because I had a cell phone right next to it. See the drop pass, and every time I put the cell phone, it uh, got close to it, it, it would it would have dropouts. So I had to put it in airplane mode. But anyway, that's my program. Do -do -do, pretty cool. If you have any questions or you need some help doing this, it was actually pretty easy and it works really well. And in fact, it's, oops, I got to have to put some underneath here so that it doesn't go through every time. But it actually does, uh, it actually solders, solders pretty well. Haven't had any problems with it using leaded solder. Okay.